Hi guys, welcome sa Sip Nayan. In this video ay tuturuin natin yung series natin on calculus. No? And in this video, magsasolve tayo ng another problem. So find all the values where uh, the function f of x equals x to the fourth minus 8x squared has a horizontal tangent line. So medyo um, parang walang calculus no? kasi walang derivative. no. But actually, uh, yung word na horizontal, no? yan yung clue. Baka tayo yung pag-isipan muna no? bago natin ituloy. So pwede nyo i-pause yung video at i-solve yung uh, problem. So, uh, i-continue ko na in 5 seconds, no? 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, so I hope na-post nyo yung video and na-try nyo yung, yung uh, uh, problem bago kayo makinig, no? Now, ano yung ibig sabihin ng horizontal tangent line? No? Ang horizontal tangent line is a horizontal line meaning meaning the slope no slope yeah, meaning the slope of this line slope of tangent line is zero no? is zero no? and pag sinabi nating slope this is the derivative no? derivative of function. So, uh, paulit-ulit ko yung sinasabi na pag sinabi nating derivative, we are actually getting the slope. If we get the derivative of a function, we are actually getting the slope of that function. No? So, ibig sabihin, kukunin natin yung derivative nito. No? So, uh, f of x is equal to x to the fourth minus 8x squared. No? But, the, the derivative is equal to bababa natin to 4 and then we have x and then bababasa natin to ng isa minus we have 2 bababa natin dito we have 2 times 8 magiging 16 tapos x no? kung hindi nyo naintindihan yung sinasabi ko uh, I suggest na balikan nyo yung mga tutorials natin kasi hindi ko na mauulit yung uh, mga detalye dito, no? ang assumption ko dito is marunong na kayo mag-derivative. No? This is uh, very basic. So, kung hindi nyo naintindihan, balikan nyo yung mga previous tutorials. So, Mag-start tayo sa 2.00. Okay, so nakuha na natin yung derivative. Ano nga ulit yung ibig sabihin ng derivative? This is the slope. No? Slope of the function. At any point yan. No? Ang sabi niya, Saan yung mga points o saan yung, uh, nasa ang value, yung uh, horizontal yung tangent line niya, meaning the slope is equal to zero. This is the slope and we want this to be zero. So we equate, no? So 4x cubed minus 16x is equal to zero. Paano yung basahin sa sentence? The slope of the function is equal to 0. So, hahanapin natin tong value ng x. Where the slope, this is the slope, di ba ito? Slope of the function is equal to 0. So, paano yan? O, from here, algebra na siya. Ito lang yung calculus nyo, no? So, we can factor out 4. 4. We have x cubed minus 16 divided by 4 is 4. O, hindi lang pala. Pwede pa pala yung x. Hindi lang yung uh, 4. So, 4x Tapos x squared minus 4, iba? Is equal to 0. So, finactor ko lang, common sa kanila yung 4, tapos common yung x. So, pwede ko sa ilabas, no? Pag nilabas ko siya, mawawala na yung 4 dito. Kasi nilabas ko na siya, tapos x squared na lang matitira kasi yung x nilabas ko dito. I factored out 4x. Ganon di dito, pag nilabas ko yung 4, uh, meaning I have to divide this by 4, E4 na lang matitira. Pag nilabas ko yung x, I have to divide this by x. x divided by x is 1. So, 4 times 1 is 1. Ito na lang Which means that 4x times x plus 2 times x minus 2 is equal to 0. Naalala nyo to? 
sum and difference of two squares, no? The difference of two squares. Yeah. So, ano na? Kailan siya magiging zero? If either uh, ito ay zero, ito ay zero, or ito ay zero. Kasi any number multiplied by zero is zero. So, pag zero to, zero na yung buong number na yan. Magiging zero na yan. Pag zero to, zero na rin to. Pag zero to, zero na rin. So, lahat yan equate natin sa zero to find the value of x. For x equals zero, which means that x equals zero. Pangalawa, x plus two is equal to zero, meaning x equals negative two. Ah, uh, ito x minus two is equal to zero, meaning x equals two. So these are these are the values. No? The mga values na hinahanap dito. No? So x equals zero, x equals negative two, saka x equals two. So at these points, no, at these uh, values of x, ang horizontal ng function na ay zero. So gusto niyong tignan? x to the fourth minus 8x squared. So i-graph natin. So f of, f of x equals x to the fourth minus 8x squared. Tama ba? Sorry, 4x to the 4th yata yun. Ano nga ba yung given natin? No, it's not 4x to the 4th, but it's x to the 4th minus 8x. Tama ba? Double check ko lang ha. x to the 4th minus 8x squared. Minus 8x squared. Hmm, tama naman pala tayo. So we want to find the part of the function values of x that makes the slope zero. No? So, tangent line yung pinag-uusapan. So, pwede natin ilagay yung tangent line at tignan natin kung saan siya nagiging zero. Bago tayo mag-tangent line, lalagyan natin ng points. Pag naging horizontal siya, definitely zero yung tangent line natin because the slope of uh, uh, horizontal line ay zero. So, nakikita nyo sa tangent line. This is the tangent line. Gawin natin red. Gawin natin red para kita-kita. Medyo very steep lang yung ating function, no? Kaya medyo hindi siya masyadong kita yung pagalaw. But I think this is enough. So, kailan siya naging horizontal? Oh, horizontal siya dito. Ano ang value ng x dito? x equals negative 2, di ba? Yung point na to. So, saan yan? X equals negative 2. Saan pa? Pag inakyat ko itong point, kailan ulit siya maging horizontal? Yun, sa point na to. Sorry. Hindi pa sa yan. Sa point na yan. So, horizontal ulit siya. Okay? That's X equals 0. Nasa gitna, di ba? So, X equals 0, which is dito. Ang huli na natin, x equals 2. At x equals 2, the tangent is horizontal. It is according to our computation. So, at x equals 2, lipat natin ito sa 2. Nasaan yung 2 dito, di ba? So, dapat na dito yung point natin sa, sa baba. So, yan. Pagdating sa baba, yung pinakababa, dito ka mag-horizontal at uh, the point here, the, the value of x is equal to 2. So, nakita nyo yung ano natin, yung uh, pag solve ng problem. Una, uh, you get the derivative because you want to uh, find the slope of the tangent line. No? And given yung slope that it is 0, kasi horizontal. Since this is the slope of the tangent line, yung fx cubed minus 16x squared, you have to equate it to 0 kasi hinahanap natin na Yung 0, ang magiging slope niya. Ito, nagbabari siya, depends sa point sa function. Then, nilagay natin yung 0. Okay, so sana ay maliwanag itong ating uh, tutorial. Uh, sana ay may natutunan kayo sa ating uh, mga discussions. Maraming salamat. I'll see you in the next tutorial.